published 1421 Eastern Standard Time, the 6th of January 2018, updated 2018 Eastern Standard Time, the 6th of January 2018. Jurgen Klopp insisted that Liverpool had done everything possible to keep Philippe Coutinho, but reluctantly they had to let him join Barcelona for a staggering 145 million pounds on Saturday. Coutinho, 25, who joined Liverpool for just £8.5 million in 2013, signed a five-and-a-half-year deal at the Now Camp. It makes the Brazilian the third most expensive footballer in history, and while many fans will be devastated to see the back of a man who has lit up Anfield, Klopp admitted that Coutinho had to go. Philippe Coutinho has been unwavering in his dream to join Barcelona since the summer. Jurgen Klopp insists Liverpool did everything in the power to try and change Coutinho's mind. The manager told Liverpool's website, It is with great reluctance that we, as a team and club, prepare to say farewell to a good friend, a wonderful person and a fantastic player in Philippe Coutinho. It is no secret that Philippe has wanted this move to happen since July, when Barcelona first made their interest known. Philippe was insistent with me, the owners and even his teammates this was a move he was desperate to make happen, despite that, we managed to keep the player here, beyond the summer window, hoping that we would be able to persuade him to stay and be part of what we are looking to do. I can tell the Liverpool supporters that we, as a club, have done everything within our means to convince Philippe that remaining part of LFC was as attractive as moving to Spain, but he is 100% certain his future, and that of his family, belongs at Barcelona. It is his dream and I am now convinced there is nothing left at our disposal to change his mind. It ends a long-running saga between Liverpool and the Catalan giants The dates back to last summer when the Anfield club turned down three offers rising to £118 million. Klopp says Liverpool will grow stronger and reminds fans that key players have left before Barcelona confirmed the move with a video showing Coutinho's shirt hanging in a locker however, following the £75 million purchase of Southampton defender Virgil van Dijk, Liverpool have decided to cash in on the star asset. Coutinho will link up with Lionel Messi and another former Liverpool favourite, Luis Suarez, with the Reds collecting more than 17 times the fee they paid for Coutinho from Inter Milan in 2013. Coutinho, who scored 54 times in 201 appearances for Liverpool, now becomes the third most expensive player in the world after Paris Saint-Germain duo Neymar and Kylian Mbappe, whose move from Monaco has been agreed even though it is currently a loan deal. Klopp added, Philippe has made a fantastic contribution to this club over his five years of service and as disappointed as we are he doesn't want to extend that, the relationship we have for him means, with a heavy heart, we wish him well, the player remained dedicated and committed to helping us win matches, producing good performances and training. Hard each day at Melwed after the summer window had closed despite failing to convince us to allow him to leave during the period, and that level of professionalism reflects positively on him, of course, it is totally understandable that supporters will be disappointed, this is always the case when you have to say goodbye to someone special. But, as hard as it is sometimes to accept, it is part of life and part of football, individuals have their own dreams and their own goals and objectives in life. Brazil international Coutinho has signed a five-and-a-half-year contract with Barcelona 2012131-3 games, 3 goals 2013-14-37 games, 5 goals 2014-15-52 games, 8 goals 2015-16-43 games, 12 goals 2016-17-36 games, 14 goals 2017-1818 games, 12 goals. Players will come and players will go. That that is football, but as a club we're big enough and strong enough to continue with our aggressive progression on the pitch, even when we lose an important player, we have never been in a better position in recent times, as a club, to react in the right way. We will use our size and strength to absorb moments like this and still move forward. I have been here long enough now to know in the history of Liverpool, he Players have left before, but the club always goes on. Speculation had been rife about Coutinho's future after he missed Liverpool's last two games with a reported groin injury. He didn't leave with the rest of his teammates for a mini break in Dubai after Friday night's FA Cup win against Everton. Coutinho will be cup tied from the Champions League, having played in the competition for Liverpool this season.
If he is to justify becoming the most expensive player in Barcelona's history, he will be expected to link up with Suarez and eventually replace Andres Iniesta. Coutinho was close to Suarez at Liverpool, living near the Uruguayan and connecting with him on the pitch. Suarez will welcome him as a neighbour again. In the long term, Coutinho has the far more ominous task of filling the boots of Iniesta, 33, one of the most decorated players in Barcelona and Spanish football history. It is with great reluctance that we, as a team and club, prepare to say farewell to a good friend, a wonderful person and a fantastic player in Philippe Coutinho. It is no secret that Philippe has wanted this move to happen since July, when Barcelona first made their interest known. Philippe was insistent with me, the owners and even his teammates this was a move he was desperate to make happen, despite that, we managed to keep the player here, beyond the summer window, hoping that we would be able to persuade him to stay and be part of what we are looking to do. I can tell the Liverpool supporters that we, as a club, have done everything within our means to convince Philippe that remaining part of LFC was as attractive as moving to Spain, but he is 100% certain his future, and that of his family, belongs at Barcelona. It is his dream and I am now convinced there is nothing left at our disposal to change his mind. Philippe has made a fantastic contribution to this club over his five years of service and as disappointed as we are he doesn't want to extend that. The relationship we have for him means with a heavy heart we wish him well. The player remained dedicated and committed to helping us win matches, producing good performances and training hard each day at Melwed after the summer window had closed despite failing to convince us to allow him to leave during the period and that level of professionalism reflects positively on him, of course, it is totally understandable that supporters will be disappointed, this is always the case when you have to say goodbye to someone special. But, as hard as it is sometimes to accept, it is part of life and part of football. Individuals have their own dreams and their own goals and objectives in life. Players will come and players will go. That is football, but as a club we are big enough and strong enough to continue with our aggressive progression on the pitch, even when we lose an important player. We have never been in a better position in recent times, as a club, to react in the right way. We will use our size and strength to absorb moments like this and still move forward. I have been here long enough now to know in the history of Liverpool, key players have left before, but the club always goes on. You cannot transfer the heart and soul of Liverpool Football Club, although I am sure there are many clubs who would like to buy it. I have so much belief in the talent we have here already and even more faith, together with our owners, that we will make continued investment into the playing squad, which will allow more growth and more improvement, so as we bid farewell to Philippe, we continue on our path of progress and development as we work towards our common goal of bringing trophies back to Anfield.